Papa, ta, 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 ta. thank you, Jesus. Thank you tonight. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you tonight. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you tonight. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Spirit of God. Thank you. Thank you tonight. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you. You are faithful tonight. You are faithful. Thank you, my God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Auto and finisher. Thank you. Thank you tonight. Thank you, Lord. We just want to bless you tonight. Looking forward to a fruitful night, a blessed night tonight. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Father God. Thank you for you are good. You are good. You are good tonight. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you. You are good. You are good. You are good to us. You are good. Refuge of strength. Thank you. Oh, our hands are your hands. Our feet are your feet. You are so good. You are so good tonight. Thank you. Thank you. God, thank you. We stretch forth our hands. We call forth intercessors. We call forth angelic assistance tonight. Commander of the army of God, you bring your intercessors. Hey, thank you. I've lifted my hands. You support it, angels of God. Thank you. Thank you. We bless you tonight. It's going to be a good night. Thank you. For you are good. You are good. Father is good. Our God is good. Our hands are stretched forth towards you tonight, Father God. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. We praise you. We praise you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for you are good. You are good. Your mercy can't fail. Your mercy can't fail. Because of your mercy, we are not consumed tonight. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, thank you. Blessed be your name. Blessed be your name. Above all powers, above all names. Your name is a miracle. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you tonight, Mommy Jonathan. God bless you. We praise God tonight. We praise God. Thank God tonight. Our God is good. Our God is good. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. God bless you. Hallelujah. God bless you, Mommy Jonathan. God is so good. We thank him. He is good. He is good. Our life is hidden in him. We are strong in him we are not ashamed because of him we thank him tonight we thank him we thank him thank you jesus thank you lord thank you we bless you god we bless you thank you thank you jesus thank you father thank you oh hallelujah hallelujah thank you god bless you tonight jeffrey god bless you hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus Thank you. Thank you, Lord. We praise him tonight. Let's praise him. Let's praise our God tonight. Let's praise him for our God is good. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Papa, Papa. Thank you, Jesus. We bless God tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be God. Blessed be God. We thank him. Blessings and honor. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you tonight, Father. We thank you. Let's praise him. Let's praise him. Blessings abound upon you tonight. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Hey, pa, 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 Thank you, Jesus. Everything is double, double. He who alone does great wonders. He alone does great wonders. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Wonder worker, miracle worker, promise keeper. Oh, hallelujah. Promise keeper. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Promise keeper. He is a promise keeper. Keeper. La Thank you, Jesus. Oh, he who has eyes like a flame of fire, he who sees, he's the one who sees. Hagar called him the one who sees. He who sees me, she called him. She said, he who sees me, he sees me, he sees me, he sees me. Thank you, Jesus. You are the great I am. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Let's praise him tonight. Let's praise him. He is good. He is good. He is good. Oh, you are great. Oh, Lord, how great is your power. How great is your understanding. It has no limits, Father God. You have strengthened the bars of our gates. You are a father of to Israel. He who sees us, he sees us. I say he sees us. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, yeah. Satatata. Thank you. You see us, Father God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You are in control. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. 
Hallelujah. Let's bless him tonight. He is good. He is good. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, we worship you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Let's bless him tonight. Let's bless him tonight. God is good tonight. We thank you. We thank you. Praise, praise, praise. He who walks in the midst of the golden seven lampstick. He's the one. Thank you, daughter Ruth. God bless you tonight. Thank you, Jesus. We thank God tonight. We thank God tonight. We thank Jesus tonight. We thank him tonight. For he is good. He is good. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. We bless him. Thank you. Thank you. We bless God. You are the great king. The great I am. The great I am. Hallelujah. The great I am. The great I am. We thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. The great I am. We thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. The great I am. The ruler of the kings of the earth. The one who is the one who was the one who is to come. We bless him tonight. Son, excellence. God bless you tonight. Hallelujah. He is faithful. God is faithful. God is faithful. I say God is faithful. He is faithful. We bless him. We bless him. We bless him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. We bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -mm. Yeah, ta 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 ta. Say ta 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 ta. God Almighty. He is the one that is, the one that was, the one that is to come. Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace, we praise Him. We praise Him tonight. They shall speak of the glory of your kingdom. We will talk of your power. I say we will talk of His power. To make known to the sons of men your mighty acts and the glorious majesty of your kingdom. That's what we are called to do. <coughs> to demonstrate your power. Oh, you open your hands and you satisfy the desires of every living creature. We praise you. We praise you tonight. Thank you. Thank you, Father. You are so good tonight. We praise you. Thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He gives grace for the race ahead. We receive that grace. Abundant grace. It's abundant grace. He cut Abundant grace. Thank you, Jesus. Abundant grace. We thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Papa, 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 thank you, Jesus, we bless you, we bless you, thank you, God, thank you, papa, thank you, we give you praise, we give you glory tonight, you are the good shepherd, the keeper of the sheep, we bless you, you are the one that sits in the heaven, you give grace to your people, we thank you, you give us the grace for the race ahead, Father, we thank you, Father, we exalt you, Father, we magnify you, God bless you, Becky. Hallelujah. He gives us a great portion. We thank God tonight. We thank God. We are here. Thank you, Jesus. He gives us a great portion. And we eat all the good of the land. We eat the good of the land. We eat the good of the land. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. God bless you tonight, daughter Grace. God bless you. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, he causes our cup to run over with goodness and mercy. We eat the food of the land. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Spirit of God. Thank you. We bless you. He causes our cup to run over with goodness and mercy. Thank you. We eat the food of the land and we are satisfied. I say we are satisfied and we are satisfied. Oh, hallelujah. We are satisfied. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. We are satisfied with your goodness. With your goodness. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be God. Blessed be God. We are satisfied with your goodness. We eat the food of the land. Thank you, Jesus. And we are satisfied with your goodness. Let's praise him tonight. For he is good. I say he is good. He is good. His mercies can't fail. His mercies do not fail. We thank him tonight. Agone chamber. You papali testa. Le castika tastalala. Mochi prekete ya sturabastakaya. Wantake stirabostikalata. Father, we thank you tonight. People of God, 
Let's begin to welcome tonight the ministry of the Spirit of Jesus, the one that raised up Jesus from the dead. Let's welcome this Holy Spirit tonight. Let's praise Him. Let's welcome the Spirit of God tonight. Hallelujah. Let's welcome Him, the Spirit of just men made perfect. Let's welcome the Spirit tonight. Hey, the Spirit of God, you turn our morning into dancing. You have put on a garment of praise upon us that our hearts may sing to you and not be silent. Let's praise Him tonight. Let's praise Him. He is good. I say He is good. Hallelujah. Thank you. The, our God is good. Our God is good. We praise Him. We praise Him. Let's praise Him. The God that is good. Welcome the Spirit of life tonight. Let's welcome Him. The Spirit that raised Jesus from the dead. The Spirit of God. Oh, Father, thank you. Thank you for your sweet spirit. Thank you for your Holy Spirit. The Spirit of wisdom. The Spirit of counsel. The Spirit of might. The Spirit that is our refuge. The Spirit that upholds us. The Spirit that is our hiding place. The Spirit of God. We worship you tonight. The one who declared light and light became a reality. The one that when he speaks, no one can overrule him. I say no power can overrule him. He is the one that after he has spoken, everyone must shut up. Thank you, Jesus, giver of all good things. Thank you, Jesus. Let us praise him. Oh, wonderful God. Thank you, Jesus. Holy Spirit, we worship you. You are the giver of all good things. All good things. Thank you. You give us so much. Welcome the Spirit tonight. We welcome him tonight. Welcome the Holy Spirit. Welcome him tonight. Welcome the Spirit of God tonight. Welcome him. Let's welcome the Spirit tonight. Welcome the Spirit of Jesus tonight. Hallelujah. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Welcome the Spirit of God. Hallelujah. We bless you. Kabiesi. Kabiesi. Chali, chali, chali. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, God, my God bless you tonight. We praise God tonight. Let's praise God. Let's praise God. Let us praise Him. Let us praise Him. Let us praise Him. His hand is already stretched forth towards us. No one can turn it back. Ekete propopo kataya. Usikalita. Let's take our Father. You take control. We reconnect in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you. God bless you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Let us praise God. Let us praise God. Let's praise the Lord Jesus tonight for He is good. He is good. We praise Him tonight. Lord Jesus, we thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. We thank the Lord Jesus Christ tonight. People of God, let us take our heavenly position tonight and let's begin to pour down the blood of Jesus. Pour down that blood tonight. Begin to pour down that blood tonight. Pour down that blood tonight. Pour it down. Pour down that blood. Let the blood of Jesus saturate our world. Let the blood come down and saturate our world, our universe, everything that pertained to us. Plead the blood. Plead the blood. The blood. The blood. The blood. The speaking blood. The healing blood. The restoring blood. Plead the blood. Plead the blood. 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 Plead the blood tonight. Plead our blood. The blood, the blood, we pour down that blood from our heavenly position where we are seated together with Christ. We pour down that blood. The blood, the blood, the blood, pour down that blood. Pour down the blood. Pour down that blood tonight. Pour down that blood. People of God, pour down the blood from the heavenly places. Pour down that blood. Pour it down. Let the blood of Jesus fall down like rain and saturate our universe. Pour down that blood. People of God, speak the blood. Speak the blood. The blood of Jesus. The blood, the blood, the blood, the blood. Speak the blood tonight. The blood of Jesus is speaking a better word. He's speaking a better word. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you tonight. God. 
God Almighty, we thank you. Let the blood speak. Let the blood speak. Let the blood speak. Let the blood of Jesus speak. La ta 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 ta. He pro pa 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 pa. Ta pa 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 pa. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Thank you for your blood tonight. Thank you, Father. We bless you. Thank you. Thank you, Jessica. God bless you tonight. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. We believe. We believe. Thank you for your blood. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. The blood, the blood, the blood, the blood. We pour down the blood, the precious blood of Jesus. The blood that speaks better things from the heavenly places tonight. The blood of Jesus over this service. I pour down the blood, the blood, the blood, the blood of Jesus over this service. Kaka kaka. Pra pa 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 pa. Pra pa 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 pa. Pra pa 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 pa. Pra pa 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 pa. Pa 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 pa. The blood, 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 the blood. Cha ta ta ta. Thank you for the blood. Let's release the hand of the angel of the Lord, the commander of the army of God, the angel of Joshua five fourteen. Unleash his hand. Ba 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 ba. Commander of the army of God. God, the angel of Joshua 5.14. Kalia, 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 Kalia. The hand of the angel of the Lord, the commander of the army of God. Let's unleash his hand in our service tonight. Kalia, Kalia. Every satanic attack against this service tonight is destroyed in the name of Jesus Thank you, God. Ba 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 Thank you, the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood in any kingdom, any altars. Let the blood of Jesus walka siprakata la ta ta ta. Let the angel of the Lord come and fight. La 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 la. In our countries tonight, in our services, let your blood flow. La cha la cha la cha la cha cha la cha la cha cha cha. The blood supra pa 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 pa. Let the commander of the army of God take over our service. Let him take over. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Almighty. Thank you, the Commander of the Army of God. You've taken over. You've taken over. Machila Tista. Baraba, baba, baba, baba. I cover the internet with the blood of Jesus. The blood, the blood, the blood, the blood, the blood. Ta 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 Thank you, Lord God Almighty. We give thanks, we give praise to Jesus tonight. I think some people are having problems with their internet. It's okay, we will just go on with the service and you can catch up with the service at a later time. In the name of Jesus, I want you to take a minute to pray for yourself that you will have light. That whatever God is trying to say to us tonight, that we will comprehend it by light. That the light of God will pierce through. The light of God will pierce through our understanding. We will have good understanding. Good understanding. Good understanding. Kakaka. La ta ta ta. La ta ta ta. La ta ta ta. La ta ta ta. Good understanding. Good understanding. Light. 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 Kaka kaka, Father, good understanding, good understanding, and the ability to implement the things you are teaching us. Thank you. We will not just be hearers only, but you will give us the grace to also do what you are teaching us. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We bless you tonight. We declare light, light, light. Thank you, Lord. We thank you for light. As we go into this time of study, your light will be so present. Your light will illuminate our path. Your light will teach us, Father God. We will have good understanding. Good understanding is our portion. It's our portion. In the name of Jesus. God bless you all tonight. In the name of Jesus, 
welcome to the service tonight we'll just thank god i don't know i think the internet is messing up i don't know if you are hearing me very well please if you are hearing me well just type uh, uh, something so that i can know because i noticed that a lot of people are coming in and out we praise god tonight in the name of jesus and today we want to uh, talk about the hand of god we started the conference about the hand of God and we did three days, but I felt that we needed one more, one more lesson. Brother, God bless you tonight in the name of Jesus. My senior brother is online to be Zoom, but anyway, God bless you, sir, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Please, everybody, say a quick hello to my big brother. <laughs> He's the one that is a, our father in the family. He's online. Say hello to him in the name of Jesus. Brother, God bless you. Hallelujah. There are certain spiritual laws that ensure the orderly, harmonious ongoing of our world. And one of those laws is the law. There are seven of them. There are seven spiritual laws that God has put in place to govern our world. And one of those laws is the law of the hand of God. There is a law of the hand of God as we discussed and we had two other guest ministers that brought in different angles to the hand of God. But I wanted to discuss with us tonight that the, your hand is the hand of God. The law of the hand of God is a law that you can depend on every day of your life. The hand of God is sure. The hand of God is capable. The hand of God is wise. The hand of God is strong. The hand of God is able to do everything that we need. But you know what? God does not have human hand. God does not have human hand. Sometimes we say, oh, oh, I'm just going to leave it in the hands of God. But God does not have human hand. Your hand is the hand of God. When you stretch forth your hand, God Almighty will confirm his word as you stretch forth your hand for your hand is the hand of God. God bless you tonight, Mommy Grace. God bless you. Your hand is the hand of God. And when you stretch for that hand, God Almighty moves as you stretch forth your hand. When things come your way, that wants to disgrace you, that wants to bring you down, you must release the hand of God into that situation. Sometimes you look at your hand and you say, oh, my hand is empty. Why do we feel that our hand is empty? It's because sometimes you think you are separate from God. When you feel that you are separate from God, then you feel that your hand is empty. But when you get to know that this hand, this hand is God's hand, then you will be able to have more faith in God and in the abilities that God has placed in you. If you go with me to Psalm 8, hallelujah, Psalm 8 verses 6. Psalm 8, verses 6. The Bible says, You have made him ruler over the works of your hands, and you have put everything under his feet. Psalm 8, verses 6 says, 
their God has made us rulers over the work of his hands. And he has put everything under our feet. God has made us rulers over the work of his hands. You are the ruler of the work of God's hand. If we do not stretch forth our hand, nothing will happen. Don't you see sometimes you just have this desire to help people. You have this desire to bless people. You have this heart you want to bless, you want to give to everybody. If you see people in need, you want to help them. You want to do anything within yourself to help people. You want to give money, you want to give accommodation, you want to give your time. You want to help people. And when you are not able to do that, you feel sad. Do you think you are the one that is desiring to help those people? It is the Spirit of God in you. It is the Spirit of God in you that is saying, that is crying, I want to use your hand to bless people. I want to use your hand. The Bible says in Deuteronomy 8, 18, Remember the Lord your God. For it is he who gives you power to create wealth so that he can use that power to establish his covenant. God gives you power to create wealth so that he can use that wealth for his glory. If God had human hands, God will do it himself, but he doesn't have human hands. Your hands are his hands. That's why he said, I will give you power. You will create wealth and we will use that wealth to establish my covenant. So I want you to know that your hand is the hand of God. That desire you have in your hand, heart to do good is the hand of God that is stretching forth out of you, wanting to bless your world, wanting to bless those people around you. It is the God in you that is crying out. God wants to give through you. God wants to bless through you. Your hand is God's hands. Our Father reaches out through your hands to bless the world. Sometimes, you know why we don't get the result that we want in our giving? Because we look at our own ability. We look at our own ability. Instead of looking at God's ability, it's God that is able. When you open your heart and you begin to allow him to give through you, the Bible says that he's the one that gives the seed to the sower. God gives the seed to the sower. And after the seed, there is bread for you too. God gives the seed to the sower. Why? He wants you to sow. He wants you to give. He wants you to feed the orphan. He wants you to feed. Your hand is the hand of God. God wants to fill your hands so that you can pass out the good freely without ceasing, so that you can give to the poor, so that you can help the people along the way. All the things that God Almighty has created, He wants us to distribute it to those who sometimes are not able to reach out. You give, you give, and you give without thinking, oh, you know, sometimes... You will give and give and give and people don't even come back to tell you thank you. Some people can even turn around and slap you after you have given them so much. Don't worry about it. They started with Jesus after he had healed those lepers. Ten of them, only one, came back to say thank you. Did that stop Jesus from stretching forth his hand? No, it did not stop him. Sometimes they will not come back. Sometimes they will not come and thank you. Don't worry about it. Sometimes you may even bless people and at the end of the day, they will betray you. It doesn't matter. Just keep giving because you see, your hand 
is the hand of God. I remember I read a testimony of a woman of God. This woman, her father was framed by a very evil man in their village. And the father was sent out of the uh, uh, community into exile. She knew her father was innocent. So she kept praying, praying. Every prayer she prayed, nothing was working. For five years, her father was in exile. So one day, she said she was just, you know, in her bedroom. She was just looking at her hand. And all of a sudden, out of the depth of her spirit, she just said, God, if only you can stretch forth your hand towards my father. And God said to her daughter, I don't have human hands. But if you can stretch out your hand, whatever you decree, I will do. So she stretched forth her hands and she said to her father in the spirit, Daddy, I release you and I release you to come home. She said after that releasing of the hand of God, within two weeks, her father, in a miraculous way, things began to happen. Things began to happen. In two weeks, her father was home. The hand of God. But you and I have to stretch forth the hand. The Bible says in the book of John chapter uh, 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 3 verse 35. John chapter 3 verse 35 says that God has put everything in the hands of the Son. God has put everything in the hands of the Son. So in your hand and in my hand is everything. John chapter 3 verses 35 says, God has put everything in the hands of the Son. In our hands is everything. Everything that we need for life and godliness, God has put it in our hands. Your hand is the hand of God. In your hand there is health. To give to the sick. There is joy to give to those who are mourning. There is freedom to give to those in bondage. There is money to those to, to give to those who are needing money. There is wisdom in your hand to give to those who need wisdom. You just need to keep your hand open. Keep your hand open for all the good gifts to keep flowing out. Keep that hand open open so that the gift can keep flowing out to your world sometimes we think we are limited so we don't give enough even in the spirit you can begin to give begin to give give what you can begin to give even as you keep giving even in your spirit you will see that the more you give the more you will have the more you will give the more you will have I got to the place in my life where I said to the enemy, there is no way I can ever lack in my life. You get to that place because you know that you are the hand of God. You want to give, so give, give because you are the hand of God. The hand of God never fails. God is looking for more people that he can trust with the things of this life so that they can give. In Psalm 145 verses 16, it says, God opens his hands and satisfies the desires of every living creature. He opens his hands and satisfies the desires of every living creature. Oh, hallelujah. If you want God to, to, to use you, that your hand be a channel, then keep your hand open. Keep that hand open. Refuse to be hindered by fear of poverty, fear of want, fear that you will not be appreciated or, just, or justly dealt with. Refuse it. 
Sometimes the devil will tell you, see how you did good. And this person has repaid you uh, 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 with, with evil. Don't worry. Don't worry. Go on giving. Go on giving to all who need it. Keep giving. For your father is a giver. It is God's word through you. As you speak that word and you give. Oh, hallelujah. As you give and you give and you give, you will see that nobody can outgive God. Remember, you cannot afford to withhold your gifts, your time, your talents, your love, your money of, to, for those who need it. You can never, never, never say, I'm not going to give. The Bible says, there is he that scattereth and yet increases, and there is he that withholds and even withholds unto his own hurt. It is good for us to keep giving because the more you give, the more it comes back to you. During the 100 days prayer, we spoke about the supply of God, the inexhaustible supply, the boundless riches of God. It, the supply is endless. It can only stop flowing when you stop providing the vessel like the woman in 2 Kings 4, 6. God said to her, go and borrow vessels and begin to pour pour the oil. She started pouring, pouring. At some point she said, oh, give me more, one more vessel. And the son said, there is no more. When she said there is no more, the oil stopped flowing. But as long as you are willing to give, as long as you are willing to continue to give, the vessel, I'm telling you, the vessels are there. There are many, many people that need help that you can give to and God is waiting to pour through you to pour forth his glory to pour forth his abundance and, and everything that he has through his children and the supply is endless when I see all the jealousy in the church I'm amazed the people of the world they are not jealous of one another do you know what the people of the world do if McDonald's want to open a, 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 a shop McDonald's will go and look for Burger King. It will go and look for perfect fried chicken. It will go and look for all the food people. They will go to one place and they will open shops there. You know what they are interested? They want the customer. They will say customer will come. If this person comes with their family, their family doesn't want to eat uh, McDonald's, maybe they will want to eat Burger, maybe Burger King. Maybe they will want to eat pizza. So if we are together, we will get, get more money. But in the church, we divide among ourselves. Oh, who is going to take the tithe if we come and work together? We don't trust one another. We don't come together to work with one another. And this is costing us a lot because when we are scattered, when we are divided, we don't have the power. We don't have the power. I was listening to a man of God today said, when the dry bones came together, then God Almighty was able to breathe life into them. But those dry bones needed to come together. When, I, when is the church going to come together? God's hand is itching. God's hand is itching. The supply of the world has not even seen anything. The world has not even seen anything of the riches of God. These inexhaustible riches. God said we should prove him. He said, prove me and see if I will not open up the windows of heaven and pour you out so much blessings that you will not have room enough to receive it. God is calling you higher. He's calling you higher for your hand is his hand. His hand, your hand is his hand. God cannot help anybody if you do not stretch forth your hand. The all that the Father has is ours. John chapter 16 verses 15. He says everything the Father has is ours. In Exodus 17, 11, there was a time that Joshua went to war. As Joshua was fighting, Joshua was busy fighting. For those of us who say, oh, leave it in the hands of God. 
as Joshua was fighting, Moses had to lift his hand up like this. Moses kept his hand up. When Moses put the hand down, Joshua began to lose. Was God not in control? God was still in control. But your hand is the hand of God. If Moses had put down his hand that day, Joshua would have lost that battle. So don't you ever just relax. Uh, now that we are praying, some people will say, Pastor, God, God, will, uh, God is going to take care of it. <laughs> and I just look at them. God is not going to take care of it if you don't take care of it. God is not going to intervene. He has given the earth to the sons of men. God has given us, the Bible says in Psalm 8 verses 6, that God has made us the rulers over the work of his hand. He said, command ye me. God said we should command him concerning his word. He said, command ye me. God said you should command. God wants us to command his word to work for us. In Job chapter 22, verses 28, Job twenty-two twenty-eight, 28, the Bible says, You shall decree a thing, and it shall be established. It didn't say God will decree it. It said you will decree that thing, and it will be established. There is a burden and a responsibility upon us as children of God. And if we do not take our place and exercise this authority, I'm telling you a lot of things will happen that we won't like. A lot of things we are waiting for God to do what he told us to do. It doesn't work like that. It doesn't work like that. God said, you shall decree a thing and it shall be established. What does that mean? It is we who will speak what we want to happen. And as we speak, then it will happen. I want us never, never to forget that it is us. It is us who is the hand of God. God is calling us to come up higher. He wants to use us for his glory. What shall we eat? What shall we drink? What shall we do? No, your heavenly father knows that you have need of all these things. God is forever giving and giving and giving and giving and giving. And we as the children of God must be standing ready to receive and give out, receive, give out, receive, give out, receive, give out. We must be ready. God is giving. Hallelujah. Everything about him is give. Bible said, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him shall not perish. God Almighty is looking at us. He wants to use us to give. That's how, what Jesus was doing. Hallelujah. Ha, blessed be God. God said, give, it shall be given back to you in a good measure. Press down, shaking together and running over. Shall men and women give back unto you? Now, God says, you have given once, but God Almighty returns it back to you. Good measure, press down, shaking together, running over. Oh, hallelujah. That blessings that runs over goes into your uh, running over account so that you can continue to give. Sometimes you may give and give and give and you will feel like, God, I'm not getting anything back. Don't worry. Don't worry. Keep giving. Keep giving. Don't stop giving. Because I'm telling you, those things that there's a scripture that says it's God that dresses the seed. I would rather have God dress my seed than man. First Corinthians, I think it's in First Corinthians 9, 9 or so. It says, God, you, you, you can give the seed, but God is the one that gives your seed a body as he sees fit. So God is the one that dresses the seed. God is the one that dresses the seed. I would rather have God dress my seed. 
So don't stop giving. Keep giving. Sometimes it's not easy. Sometimes it's a sacrifice. Don't stop giving. It will come back to you. It will come back to you in a good measure. Press down. Shaking together and running over. Shall men and women give back to you? If you look at the life of Jesus Christ when Jesus was in the world. Hallelujah. Jesus always stretched forth his hand. Each time you will see Jesus, he will stretch out his hand to heal the leper. Jesus will stretch out when Peter's mother was sick with a fever. Jesus stretched forth his hand and laid that hand on her and she was healed immediately. Two blind men came to Jesus and they were crying. Jesus touched their eyes. He used his hand. There is life in this hand. The Bible says that God has put everything inside our hands. Everything is in this hand. Peter's, uh, these two blind men came. Jesus reached forth his hands and touched them and said, Receive your sight. Immediately they received. When there was no food in the wilderness, Jesus took two loaves and three fishes. Jesus laid his hand and it became, it multiplied and became surplus to feed over 5,000 people. Jesus Christ multiplied the bread, he multiplied the wine, he touched it and it turned to abundance. Do, do you think that we cannot do the same? He said, Jesus said that we will do even greater works than him. He multiplied those fishes, he multiplied a lot of things. He touched the man with the withered hand and that withered hand became straight. Hallelujah. A father brought his son to Jesus Christ to be healed and Jesus rebuked that condition and took the boy by the hand and gave the boy back to his father. Jesus Christ, his hands, he used that hand to heal the leper. He used that hand, that hand to do so much. Hallelujah. Our hand is the hand of Christ. The work that he started here on earth, he wants us to make our hands available so that he can use it. And telling you, if you and I don't extend our hands, God can't do nothing as big as he is. God has bound himself in such a way that he can't even move on this earth unless somebody works with him. God is calling us to, 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 to know that uh, his hand it's our hand and our hand is his. Don't worry about the supply. You just be willing to give. And the supply will come. God gives us. The hand of God gives us. When we are ready to release ourselves to him and to his laws. His hands is always open. His hands is always outstretched. Nobody can turn it back. His hand is always ready. His hands is always Looking to find a way, a channel to walk through, a door to enter through. If we will but trust and be obedient and allow him to use us. The shame is that sometimes God gives people and then they begin to hold it for their own use. They hold it. They don't use it for the purpose which is supposed to be used. Oh, I am now the richest pastor in the world. I have a jet and yet you have members in your church that can't even send their children to school. Ooh, shame, 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 shame. You have forgotten what the word is for. You have forgotten the purpose for the money. You have forgotten why God blessed you. You have forgotten. Shame, you shame, shame, shame. If you still have members in your church that can't even pay their rent. Ah, and you are riding that limousine. Shame, shame, shame. Shame, shame, shame. You have forgotten the covenant. You have forgotten the covenant. God does not give us wealth so we can go where snakes skin bags. God gives you money. God gives you ability so that he can use you to establish his covenant. As long as there are people around you that can't even feed. Like, don't tell me that you are rich because you are not rich. If you are the richest pastor in the world, let me may come to your church and see that every member in your church has a home, their children are well fed, their children are educated, then I know that you are truly the hand of God. Hallelujah. 
Our God is a good God. God is looking for men and women that he can trust. Are you ready to give him your hand so that he can use your hand? Oh, hallelujah. God, can God rely on you? Can God trust you? Oh, hallelujah. Can God Almighty use your hand? For this hand is the hand of God. Hallelujah. Your hand is the hand of God. God wants to use this hand to deliver. God wants to use this hand to bless, to heal, to guide in every circumstance in life. Oh, hallelujah. You can commit your affairs and the affairs of your family into the hands of God. Don't you ever be afraid to think, oh, if I, if I give God my hand, God will not look after me. God will look after you. God will look after your family. God Almighty will look after everything that concerns you. For his hands are so, so, so big. But that hand is your hand. I say that hand is your hand. Hallelujah. Our God is a faithful God. Our God is a merciful God. Our God is kind. The Bible says... That God Almighty gives us the ability to create wealth. The ability to create wealth. The Bible says that God has made you the ruler over the work of his hand. Psalm 8 verse 6. You are the ruler of the work of God's hand. That's a big responsibility. God created us in his image. He said, I give you, I give you, I give you. Because we are created in his image, he has told us that it is his good pleasure to give us the kingdom. We can rest assured that no good desire is beyond the capability of his hands. He will prove to you daily that he is faithful as you open your hands so that he can use your hand. Thank you, Jesus. I want us to be encouraged. I want us to know that we are the hands of God. I want us to know that God has put everything in our hand. That thing you are crying for, you are saying you don't have it, is already in your hands. The Bible says in Psalm 145, 16, He opened his hands and satisfies the desire of every living creature. Does God have human hand? It's your hand. When you open your hand, you will satisfy the desires of every living creature. For you are the hand of God. Lay the hands on yourself and gift yourself with the things that you want. Give them to yourself as a gift. It's in your hand. Give as a gift. Those things you want are already in your hands. God cannot lie. John 3.35, he said, God has put everything in the hands of the Son. Everything is in our hands. And I want you to know that when we have learned that God is our supply and that from him comes all our help, we shall no longer care whether people come and pay us or not, whether people come and thank us or not, we shall just keep on giving because we know that as we give, so it's come back to us in ways which we can't even comprehend because God's hand is a sure hand. God's hand is a strong hand. God's hand is your hand. Uh, hallelujah. That hand is full. Right now, that hand is full of the goodness of God. Give out of it mentally. Give to who, who call upon you. Give to those who need your help. Trust also in him and he will bring it to pass. I want you to begin to thank God for this message. Let's begin to thank him for this message tonight in the name of Jesus. Let's begin to thank him. Let's begin to thank our God tonight. Father God, your hand, your hand, your hand, 
Thank him. Your hand, your hand is the hand of God. Is the hand of God. God can only heal through you. God can only bless through your hand. For you, 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 ba, 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 as you are willing to go for him, as you are willing to obey him, as you are willing to stretch forth your hand, then your hand is already filled with good that you can give to the world. Thank him tonight. Thank him tonight. For he opened his hands and satisfied the desire of every living creature. Ba, 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 Thank him for this message. Thank him. Thank him. We will no longer beg for what is in our hands. We will no longer cry for what is in our hands. We will no longer ask people to do for us what is already in our hands. Our hands are loaded. Our hands are filled with good. With good. Thank you, God. You open it your hands and you satisfy the desires of every living creature. Father, I open my hand. I sakataka. I want you to begin to gift yourself. What are those things you've been wanting? There are things you've been wanting that you thought you will never have them. Begin to gift yourself with those things, for it is in your hand. It's in your hand. Gift yourself with love life with beauty with strength gift yourself with oh wisdom gift yourself with abundance gift yourself with everything you need for it is in your hand you eat first then you give to others yeah, ta, ta, ta. the breast is heavy papa's breast is heavy it there is more than enough for the whole world kalia kaka 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 Gift yourself, gift yourself, gift yourself with the gift of life. Give yourself those gifts that you've been looking left and right, thinking someone else has to do it. You gift yourself. Thank you, God. Hey, papa, 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 papa. I gift myself, Father. Breakthrough, open doors, increase, abundance, ability. I gift myself happiness, joy, marital bliss. I gift myself blessed children. I gift myself the blessings of the world. I gift myself. I gift myself. You give to yourself. You give to yourself. Then you stretch forth and you begin to give to the world. You begin to give to the world. World. Thank you, thank you, God. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Your kaka kaka, your hand is the hand of God. Whatever situation you find yourself, whether you need healing, whether you need supply, whether you need harmony, whether you need peace, strength, you can be sure that the activity of God is already stirring within you and within those around you who are concerned. He, <laughs> oh, hallelujah, He already has the whole world in your hands. Oh, hallelujah. God's word is in your hands. The Bible says he has put everything in the hands of the son and he has made you the ruler over the work of his hands. Father, thank you tonight. We thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you. Whatever it is, I want you to begin to calm down. Calm down so that you can hear him. Give to yourself, then give the word. For God Almighty has put everything in your hand. Your hand is the hand of God. God has given you power to create wealth so that he can use that wealth to establish his covenant. Praise him. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you. Papa, 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 Thank you, Jesus. Father, we thank you tonight. We believe, Father God, that our hands are your hands. Lord, stretch forth your hand and dedicate it to God tonight. Dedicate that hand to God. Tell God to fill your hand so that you can feed the world, so that you can heal the sick. Dedicate your hand to the Lord. Dedicate your hand to the Lord. Father, I dedicate my hands to you. Oh, Father, you are the one that gives the seed to the sower and bread for food. I thank you. 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 I dedicate my hands to you. Use my hand. Use my hand. Use my hand for your glory. For your glory. For your glory. Thank you, Jesus. I dedicate these hands to you. Use it for your glory. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. In the name of Jesus. 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Remember that your hand is God's hand. God wants to use your hand to bless the world. And your hand we never lack oil in the name of Jesus. I want you please to join me. There's a friend of mine that sent me an email that her, her neighbor's son was kidnapped. I want us to pray for, for them. His name is Suleiman. Please, let's join our voices together and pray that the angel of the Lord will go and bring that boy safely back to his family. In the name of Jesus, his name is Suleiman. Father God, we thank you tonight. We pray for Suleiman in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, thank you. You know where this little boy is. Father, separated from his family. In the mighty name of Jesus, I go in the realm of the spirit. Wherever that boy is, right? Right now and I command the rescue, 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 kaka kaka, kaka kaka, kaka kaka, kaka kaka, rescue, 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 papa papa, papa papa, papa papa, father you have rescued him from the hands of the wicked, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, ba ba ba, 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 ba you have rescued him. From the hands of the wicked. Suleiman, thank you, thank you. We believe, we believe, we believe in the name of Jesus. People of God, begin to pray for yourself tonight that God Almighty, the creator of the ends of the earth, will lead you, hallelujah, guide you, direct your footsteps into all truth. No weapon from against your life or your family shall prosper. Any tongue that rises against you or your family in judgment is condemned. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. La ta ta ta. 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 La ta 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 ta. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. We break every satanic yoke in the name of Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Father. We thank you. We bless you and we honor you in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we bless you. We declare you by your hand straight forth towards Suleiman. No one can turn it back. Your hand that delivers. Your hand that saves. Thank you, Father God. In the mighty name of Jesus, we bless you. We bless you. People of God, begin to cover yourself, your family, everything that belongs to you with the blood of Jesus tonight. We plead the blood, the blood, the blood. Ka -ka -ka -ka. Ka -ka -ka -ka. We return every satanic arrows, every witchcraft, every demonic attack of hell. We send it back. We send it back. We send it back. Kalia, 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 Baba Baba, Baba Baba, Baba Baba, Baba Baba, Baba Baba, Baba Baba, A Flaka, Sapla Kata, 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 Lata, Lata, Lata Tata. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we thank you tonight. We cover our lives with the blood of Jesus. We declare the goodness of God and the mercy of God in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let us bless our water. Thank you, Jesus. Then the angel, Revelation 22, then the angel showed me the river of the water of life, as clear as crystal, flowing from the throne of God and of the Lamb, down the middle of the great street of the city. On each side of the river stood the tree of life, bearing twelve crops of fruit, yielding its fruit every month, and the leaves of the tree are for the healing of the nations. 
No longer will there be any curse. For the throne of the God Almighty and of the Lamb will be in the city. And his servants will serve him. No more curse. No more curse. As we partake of the waters of the rivers of life. We stretch forth our hands towards a greater destiny. The sun is shining. It, the, and the moon and the stars are all rooting for us. We are blessed. We are blessed. Our nations are blessed. The demons of hell waging war against our nations. They fall for our sake. They fall to pieces for our sakes. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you. Let's partake of the water of the river of life tonight. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. God bless you all. Nice to see you. In the name of Jesus, may the Lord bless you. I'm looking forward. We are going to have um, a two-day conference at the weekend. I'll, you know, prepare the flyers and everything, and it will be on my Facebook page. May the Lord bless you all and keep you, make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. God bless you. And I'll see you at the weekend. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hallelujah. Blessed be God. Oh, hallelujah. I forgot to introduce some of the books. Oh, Secrets to a Blissful Pregnancy and Pain-Free Childbirth. It's one of those amazing books that God wrote through me. That he is using to help women who are pregnant to overcome every form of pain in their pregnancy. Hallelujah. Another great book is Who Said You Are Too Old to Conceive. It's another great book that the Lord wrote that he's using mightily to help women who have been told that they are too old to have children. Another great book is By Faith, I Received My God-Given Job. This one is good. It will help you to know how to get a good job at this time in the name of Jesus. Those are some of the amazing books that we have in the Overcoming Infertility Collection. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you all, and I'll see you at the weekend. Bye-bye. Praise God. <laughs>